Hello, this is Mike, nostressmike.com. And, uh, uh, here, let me step outside here. It looks like the clouds, uh, we miss the rain. Uh, I don't know if you can even see the clouds. There's dark clouds. And, uh, by the way, that was the sun. Um, it's funny, I got a, a notice from, a, I don't know if you saw the, the bullfight arena, but I didn't even show the bullfight. And uh, uh, they got me for, um, um, what do you call it, copyright. For the music, you know, there's music playing everywhere. Everywhere there's music. You see, the only place there isn't is here, <laughs> and that's why uh, I'm all the time in a safe spot when I make uh, videos. Usually, but sometimes I I take chances and stuff like that. Uh, they said that. Uh, I don't really understand uh, what it's all about, but I'm I'm not because I got two strikes, and I can you know all I got to do is just pull the plug and that's it. And so if you don't see me one of these days, you know that's what happened. I screwed up somewhere, but um, uh, anyway, they said that it doesn't affect my my standing on the the, the witch call. Uh so so anyway. Uh, but they did bring it to my attention and I don't know if they took the video off. I, I have no idea what's going on. And uh, uh but anyway and uh I uh I don't have a grill now, and um, we've got one coming. Um, she's in Veracruz, and um, you know, I've, I think I've said, um, I've been getting a lot of 20s and 30s, and that's not what I'm looking for. Um, and uh but they keep coming you know i mean it's an american and and uh you know so so they keep showing up uh but this gal uh from veracruz is uh 42 and uh i want uh someone upper 40s and 50s and 60s but it is, it's not going to happen. I don't think so. And uh, I'm, I'm coming to the... Um, I, I don't know. Uh, how do I get, get these more mature uh, women? You know, I don't, I don't know. And, uh, but anyway... Uh, I, I don't quite understand. She said, uh, I told her, uh, they gave me her, her uh, uh, name and, uh, uh, telephone number. So I've, uh, uh, put her on, uh, uh, WhatsApp, WhatsApps. And, uh, and I've been writing her. Not so much. Uh, and another thing that mess, screwed me up is uh, uh, I sent her uh, 3,600 pesos and uh, so she can get an airline ticket to come. And uh, she's supposed to. Uh, she's supposed to do it. Now, you don't do that stuff. But, uh, but I do. And... Uh, so, uh, but the thing is, 
her brother was a chauffeur for my friend, the one that I'm here visiting. And uh, in 2002, he was his chauffeur. And uh, so I'm going by that. And uh, she's supposed to uh, get the ticket, a uh, plane ticket from Veracruz, and she's going to come. And then I pick her up at uh, uh, Mer Moran, Moran, Murda, but whatever town that is. Uh, I, when she flies in on that, I got to pick her up on that. Uh, but my friend's gonna have to go with me because I don't know who she is. I don't, I don't know what she looks like. I don't have any idea. And uh, all I know is uh, my friend says, "Oh, well, she's good looking." <laughs> you know. And now the, I will admit, um, my friend's been sending good looking gals. I will admit that. Um, so I'm not. Not really sure, uh, but anyway, so I think he's gonna have to go with me to get her at the airport, and then uh, I'll bring her back. Uh, and I say right now, I've been trying to talk to her uh, on the on WhatsApp, and it's it's not hasn't worked out good at all. Uh, she doesn't. Uh, she's not. Um, She's not getting it. Uh, and I told her, don't be scared. And then she uh, uh, wrote back, uh, no, you do. So we lost something in the, the, the translation. So, uh, but anyway, um, <laughs> and she's supposed to call this evening. And so uh, uh, I gave her my number for my Mexican phone so she can call me. And then, uh, and then she says, she wrote me, and she said, well, get somebody that speaks English to be with me when I answer the phone. I told her, I don't know anyone that speaks English. <laughs> I mean, I'm in the back, the, 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 the back country of uh, Yucatan. And uh, uh, so it's not that easy. And uh, so I hope it doesn't scare her because that's part of uh, uh, the learning process and it's a part of the connection that we have when she's talking and I'm trying to figure it out. She's gonna learn English while I'm learning Spanish. So they say, but it, I don't. And uh, so it's real funny. Uh, and then it's funny when I tell people, oh, I lived 14 years in Guatemala. And uh, they just, they, and you don't know Spanish? <laughs> and I had the same problem in uh, Guatemala. My wife and her family could speak English. Most everybody else didn't speak English, so uh, it was it was a challenge. And uh, but anyway, we're going to see what happens. And um, uh, I want to see if she's coming. And then when she comes, I want to see if she's going to uh, if she's got the attitude that she uh, wants to, you know, wants to wants to do this stuff because it's it's work. And uh, being with me is work. And this is what people don't understand, that they think, well, you're just vacationing. Uh, it's not. Uh, it's a lot of work. And uh, we, we try to get things done. And if um, the people I'm dealing with if it's not getting done like they want it to be, we got major problems. And so uh, uh, that's, that's, that's what's going on. Uh, and that's why I think it's funny when people say, oh, 
get a translator, you know, get an app that goes, yeah, no, no, it doesn't work that way. Um, if maybe for um, friendly discussions, if you want to talk to somebody on a one-on-one -on -one basis, maybe it might work. Uh, uh, my stuff is, is never like that. And, um, but anyway, uh, it's, it's been fun. Um, I, uh, my visa is up in September. So, uh, um, if I'm, and they asked me, are you going to fly back or are you driving back? Uh, if I drive back, that means I'm pretty much in my stay here. Uh, if I fly back, uh, that means I was able to get a, a Mexican tag from a car. And I can leave my car here, fly back, and I'll ride my motorcycle. Uh, but I haven't had much luck with that. Um, I've got uh, someone in uh, uh, Mexico City that's working on it. And then um, I had an American guy uh, here. Uh, he's, I think he's gone now. But um, he was supposed to check on it, see if he could find something. Nobody, nobody knows how to, how to do it. And uh, so I can go to uh, uh, Belize, and then I can do my thing there. And that might be what I do, but I can't do it by myself. Uh, I say I don't have a GPS uh, that will do it. Uh, people say, oh, just get a GPS. Well, it sounds good, but the GPS is in Spanish. And, uh, but my GPS, I forgot to, to set my uh, GPS when I was in the States for Mexico and Central America. And so I don't have it. I was lucky to get here. I mean, it was very difficult. And, uh, but anyway, uh, that's what's going on. Uh, right now, I'm just uh, waiting. Well, I got a, uh, a girl I want to take out, uh, uh, 38, I think she's 38 years old. I want to take her out tomorrow. And uh, I just, uh, she, she was one of the girls that were, were with me. And uh, she's kind of fun. So uh, we're gonna, I'm going to try taking her out again tomorrow. Uh, but anyway, uh, that's it. This is Mike, nostressmike.com.